my thought process is act in the place that you want to be. And so it's the all about the mentality. And so for me, whenever I have networking events or different things like that, I always dress the part. Mm -hmm. When I tell you, I want to walk into that event and I want to be the loudest, brightest, swearing thing. Like, I want people to be like, you see that girl that walked in with a lime green dress? And like, I just want that to be my presence because not only do I want you to gravitate to me, but once I start talking about my mission and vision, you're like, okay, everything makes sense. Yeah. And so it's just being very intentional about how I engage with these organizations, because the thing is, People see audacity and they're like, oh, you're only a year in. It's like, no, I have experience in this, but COVID, you know, but also not using COVID as an excuse. So I'm very intentional about the way I move about these spaces, the way I try to build these relationships. And I have a lot of things to learn and I'm very transparent with my team and the people that I work with. You know, I've had some wins and I've had some losses within the last couple of weeks. Yesterday was one of those days as I was listening to your podcast Yesterday was one of those days where I was just like, Dag, I really should just go back to my cubicle. Like she was saying in the episode, I should go back to my cubicle and just mind my business. Because why did I leave when I was comfortable? But it was like, this is not my season of being comfortable. And so I'm embracing it. I'm leaning into it. I had some very tough conversations today, but I walked away feeling like, okay, we can make it to the end of the year, at least, at least. 